द पर्पल फ्लेम कॉन्ट्रैक्ट द लाइट एंड फायर व स्नफ्ट आउट वेन द साइलेंट स्टॉम ऑफ द इमूवेबल विंस ऑन वलोब्ड मदर अर्थ द लास्ट लाइटनिंग एस्केप्ड अवे फ्रॉम द अर्थ इन टू द स्काय एंड ग्रेविटी ट्रेम्बल्ड द वॉटर्स फ्रॉम द ग्रेट डीप स्टार्टेड ओजिंग आउट ऑफ द अर्थ and mankind found themselves sinking into these waters along with the waters came a bevy of torches floating on the waters humans picked one each as a token of security under their new reality when they did sink completely into the new buoyancy defying waters they stood standing with an acquired ability to breathe comfortably within the surrounded water and from their first breath the torches were kindled to bright purple flames only the infants stood out holding the bare torches as they had not learned to breathe yet an inscription in many languages on the torch insinuated that the flame would eventually consume the bearer if it was not put away in due time however the breath of a lying mouth serves as a fuel to the torch the bane was certainly a consequence of their willful choices but the grace of impunity was offered on a condition of fulfilling the purple flame contract The purple flame contract offers impunity to those who find a suitable substitute who is a grave liar than themselves as the contract counsels all we need to do is to bump the torch with the potential substitutes and fall apart from the vanity it was a gateway of escape once a relative evil liar is recognized the stage was set to buy the grace of impunity in the beginning many wives accidentally bumped into their husbands and flames on their torches were immediately put off but when those women flogged together their torches were lit back many naive people were surprised when they found their substitutes within their close circle of friends and colleagues however their torches were lit back from bumping into their blood relatives among all those who had the privilege of being regarded as the ideals were inflated with the shame of hypocrisy under the torch of the purple flames after that hour of conviction the flames on their torch were only growing brighter the corporate clients were found running behind their agencies both white and blue collared employees were found chasing their corresponding employee during this hustle of one torch dwindling between on and off one safest bet was to find the politicians but they were among the first to go into hiding ponzi's brokers financial agents were men of great demand to quench these purple flames besides the great uproar under the purple flames it was a humorous irony to see some of the places of worship houses of charity social service agencies and houses of overseeing peace and fraternity shining brighter than ever as the purple flames were hovering the pleasure of impunity stood satisfactory only when the substitute was found in a known liar than in a trusted friend into the last hour of the contract of the purple flames only counted few were standing with bare torches and then the infants started crawling towards them